Today, I will be showing you how you can get free domain and hosting and launch your WordPress website for free. Like I said, you don't need to buy anything over here. Everything is going to be completely for free. So just make sure you hit the like button for me and let's quickly get into it. So what we need to do first is to come over to our browser over here and then we're going to search pantheon.io. You don't need to worry about this link at all because I'll be leaving every link in the description of this video for you. So after everything, you just go to the description and then you're gonna click on the link over there or you copy and paste it in your browser. So this is pantheon.io that is showing right here on Google. This is the link that we want. So when you see it like this, you just click on it. And then simply this link has redirected us to the pantheon website this is where we are going to launch our wordpress website for free we are not going to pay anything for it all you have to do is to simply create a free account over here by clicking here start free and then it will be asking us to fill this form over here in order to get started so for us to create accounts very easily we have to connect with our google account so first you need to sign in with the google account on your browser okay so just click here to connect with google and then over here it will display our google account okay so if that is the account you want to use just simply just select it so right here you can see it has redirected us straight forward to the pension website this is where we are going to launch our wordpress website now we have finished creating our account so let's go ahead and complete this step over here let's simply enter our name over here so you're gonna enter your name so you can enter anything over there so let me enter last name over here and then you're gonna select your country from here like i said you can also select any country that you want and then if you want promotional messages you can tick this i don't want promotional messages because sometimes it's too much and then you're gonna come over here are you an agent yes or no i'm not an agent and then you can click here agree with the terms and conditions but make sure you read the terms and conditions is very important okay so click here continue so right now our account is fully set it will be asking you to take a tour you just make sure that you close this because that is why i'm here to teach you you don't need to take any tour again okay so as soon as you land on this interface over here we are going to launch our wordpress website right now so just come over here and click create new site and then right here we are going to select wordpress so right after selecting wordpress you can see it's showing this interface for us again and this is what we are going to do we are going to enter our site name over here so you can enter any site name that you want over there so i'm going to enter something like gen 2020 and then you can leave the country on united states and then you're gonna come over here and click continue so right from here it's going to start deploying our wordpress website you can see deploying wordpress so we can launch the wordpress website directly from here so you just need to wait for some time so right from there you can see the deploying process has end successfully so what we need to do next is to click here visit your pentium site dashboard so as soon as you arrive yourself on this interface what you want to do next is to just go ahead and click here no thanks because i'm here to teach you and then come over here and then you're gonna select site admin so it will open new tab and then it's going to start installing wordpress for you now before we proceed with the process in case you want me to build your website for you make sure you check the link in the description or check the number on this banner and make sure you get in touch with me any website at all your e-commerce website your portfolio whatever website that you want make sure you check the link in the description and get in touch with me and i'm gonna do that for you very nicely now let's go ahead and install our wordpress website so over here just come down here and click continue and then what you want to do next is to enter your site title over here so your site title must always align with your needs for example if i'm launching a website on travel and tour i can just write my site title as travel and see or travel today you can write anything that is related to the site that you are launching okay so right now let me just write something like travel and see 
I'm not saying you should write the same thing, but just choose a side title that you can put over there, okay? So over here that it says username, I can just write something like travel C. You are going to use this username and your password in order to log in wherever you want to log into your WordPress dashboard. So make sure you take note of your username and password. Now over here it will be generating automatic password for you for you to use. You can also use it or you can decide to change it. Okay, so you can decide to change it to anything that you want to add to it. And then you can see right now the password is showing strong. Anytime it's showing strong, it's okay for you. Okay so you can keep this password just copy and paste it on your notepad somewhere with the username so that anytime you want to log in with your website you can easily use it or without a password you can still log in straightforward from the pension website okay so let's proceed what we want to do next is to put in our email address over here so right now let me just put in my email address over here and then right here where you take this it means that you don't want search engine in order to crawl this website or index this website but when you allow it like this it means that you want search engine to crawl your website and index it in another word it means you want google to show your website in its search engine so just leave it like this in case that is what we want then come over here and click install wordpress so right here you can see it's asking us to log in everything is successful just click here to log in and then you can see it has redirected us to the login page of wordpress because our wordpress website is launched successfully so our username and password is already here for us in case you store it down so you can also use it another time in the future okay so just come over here and click remember me anytime you are logging in next time it's not going to be a problem so click here to log in now so right here we have successfully arrived ourselves on our wordpress dashboard this is where we are going to build our website right now now in case you are new to wordpress whatever you see over here are menus that you can use in order to build your website and what you see over here are informations that are being given to you anytime from wordpress so what you are going to do is simply come to the top over here to screen option and make sure you uncheck all these things so that you have a very clean environment in order to start building your wordpress website when you finish click here and then everything is gone as you can see okay so what we are going to do now is let's preview our website in a new tab and then let's see how exactly our website is looking before we're gonna start building and also we're gonna see the outcome so let's first see how our website is looking okay so this is how our website is looking right now you can see we have successfully installed a free wordpress website over here and this is how it's looking now let's go ahead and make sure that we build our website or we design it very well so let's go back to our wordpress dashboard and this is what you need to do first come to settings and make sure you come to where it says permalinks it's very important okay and then simply make sure you remove permalinks from day and name and put it on post name this will help search engines in order to index your website and your post very well so click here post name and then you're gonna click here save changes so right after doing that what you need to do next is to install some plugins okay so those plugins we are going to use them in order to design our website right now so let's rover our mouse on plugins and then quickly we're gonna come and click install plugins and then at default you can see we have some plugins over here on our dashboard we don't need these plugins for now so let's click here and then you can see everything is selected over here and then you come to bulk action and then you're gonna click here delete and click here apply and click ok so everything will be deleted now as our plugins are deleted let's go ahead and add our new plugin so click here add new plugin and then you're gonna come over here and then let's write Astra that is the plugin and the theme that we want to use okay so as soon as you write Astra you're gonna see this this Astra starter template over here that is what we are going to use to build our site so click here install and then you're gonna click activate so right here it will be asking you in order to build with templates or try new ai builder because now astra is having ai builder okay but we don't want to use the ai builder let's click here build with templates and then we're gonna select elementor that is a paid builder that we want so let's select elementor 
so right from here it will be displaying very beautiful templates for us different beautiful templates as you are seeing and then you can select any template based on your niche over here so you can see business local business personal care professional personal site and then all of them are having drop down menus okay so you can select any of them in case you want to build a blog you can see blogger over here food blog travel blog over here fashion and then the rest okay so over here i just want to select one of these templates for the sake of this tutorial okay so let me just go ahead and select this one for example this is a travel and tour blog over here so let me just click here outdoor adventure so you can also select any other template that you want so right after selecting it you can see it will be showing the preview over here for you it means that this is how your website is going to look like okay so everything is going to change like this okay i like this so you can just go ahead and then if you have a logo design already which is having a transfer background you can just come over here and upload your logo but i just want to leave this for now i can do that in the future okay so just come over here and skip to continue and then you can also go ahead and select any color that you want over here for instance when i pick this color you can see this button has changed this one has also changed and then when i pick this color again you can see things has changed again so just select any color that you like you can also select different fonts that you like over here and click continue just go ahead and enter your first name over here you can enter any name at all that you want to enter over there and then right here you can enter your email address that you want over here and then you can just go ahead and select if you are beginner intermediate or expert we just assume that we are beginners okay so over here you can select myself or my company or anything you want to select and then quickly come here submit and build my website so right here you can see our team and our starter templates are installing let's wait for some time and see how our website is going to look after everything is being installed so congratulations right here our wordpress website is being successfully installed let's click here to view our website so right now this is how our wordpress website is looking let's view and see how everything is looking it's having a blog post over here you can see everything is being displayed very nicely right here for us and then this page you can go ahead and customize it anytime that you want simply you're gonna come to this place that it says edit with elementor and then you can simply drag and drop and edit everything over here let's say for instance let me go to about and see how the page is looking over here you can see everything is very nicely designed over here okay so this is how you can build your free wordpress website in case you don't like this template and you want to change it you can simply go back to where it says the starter template over here and then you're gonna click on this s over here it's gonna take you back to the starter templates and then you can select any one of them okay so it's, that is simple way to build your free wordpress website in case you want to build your blog website for commercial purposes or adding ads to your website and make money then this particular website is not that thing that you want okay you need to buy domain and hosting i'll be leaving a link in description for you to buy domain and hosting from namecheap or from hostinger any of them can easily help you in order to build that website and if you want me to build a website for you too i can do that for you this website is just for educational purpose or informational purposes only okay so if you want to engage in building an e-commerce website and the rest then you must always buy domain and hosting all right that is how you can launch your free wordpress website right here my name is sir francis make sure you subscribe to this channel and also make sure that you hit the bell notification so that anytime i drop new video you can be able to watch it all right see you in the next tutorial